From snow to rain, I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. Winter weather advisory still in effect for South Jersey through 9 p.m. this evening here across the area. We have seen snow, but it is changing over to rain here. State of emergency still in effect for the state of New Jersey. State precipitation has broken up for now, and we will see the steadier precipitation move back in as we go deeper into the p.m. commute and really after dark here. However, it will be changing to rain. It's already changed to rain in portions of Cape May County and that is working north through the afternoon here. Temperatures are rising above 32 degrees as well. Here is our temperature advection as of 3 o'clock. And what this is saying is how much warmer or colder is the air going to be in regards to where it is now or about three o'clock this is for the upper levels of the atmosphere about 10,000 feet high notice a lot of red and it is moving into new jersey here so we will be warming up here temperatures will be rising through the 40s during the overnight hours 3 p.m radar see that steadier snow has broken up here and what we are looking at now is just scattered snow showers however there is rain to our south this will eventually push into our area but as you see to our south and west it is mainly rain Rain, a little bit of sleep, but it will change over to all rain as we go forward in time. Highest snowfall totals as of Wednesday afternoon. Hamilton takes the top spot at 2.6 inches of snow. About what we expected here. We'll still add a little bit to this. These are our top five. Generally, we're in between the one and a half to three inch range. 4 p.m. on Wednesday. This is what we're expecting. A little bit of sleet, a little bit of snow, a little bit of rain. Rain mostly to the south. More snow further to the north you are. Notice how that rain fills back in for 7 p.m. However, it is all rain for us here and then we will see rain through the evening starting to taper down after midnight and really as we zoom in here to 7 a.m it's out of here by 8 a.m at the absolute latest and i believe most of us will be done by about 5 a.m here is our snow and sleep map it worked out pretty good here from what my initial thoughts were on monday afternoon coating the two inches for a good chunk of cape may county shores of the delaware bay right along the jersey shore two to four for a good chunk of cumberland most of Atlantic and all of mainland Ocean County. And then as we go into the northwest suburbs of Philadelphia, four to seven inches of snow. I'll show you the top five again so we can compare to what we have on the snow map here, generally between two to 2.6 in our highest locations, which is just around this area here. And that's where we have that two to four lower totals as we go further to the south. Coastal flooding had a little bit on Wednesday morning in Cape May from our Brigantine down to Cape May. We are expecting minor flood stage. So the first block or two of Bayside roadways will have water on them. And we will watch out for spotty road closures, especially on the Black Horse Pike, White Horse Pike, and Shore Road. Not a definite, but something to keep in mind as we go through the AM commute. And actually the high tides will be between 9 AM to 10 AM. A couple other notes for you. Code Blue is in effect for Ocean County on Wednesday night here. Doesn't look like we're gonna get the precipitation at AC Airport in terms of its records. So we would get there. We're gonna need a good shot of rain really this evening to get up to that point. It's about 0.84 inches of rain and melted snow. No flash freeze tonight because temperatures will eventually rise and Spirit Airlines has no travel advisory in effect for Atlantic City International Airport. Mainland seven day forecast as we go into Thursday, rain ends very early and then we see a mild day temperatures in the upper 50s for the mainland, low 50s for Friday with filtered sunshine throughout the area. Then we go into the weekend. We are expecting rain, not snow and it's not a washout either day, though I will say Sunday will be the drier of the two days and also much warmer 60 degrees in places like Hamilton and Folsom and Mullica Township are likely and then we get very windy here potential for damaging wind gusts actually from Sunday into Monday but we will keep you updated with that as we go after this storm here temperatures fall back down to reality I'll show you the a seven day for you here temperatures stay above freezing for much of the seven day until we get until Monday night we'll be continuing to update you on the snow as it changes over to rain as well as the coastal flooding tomorrow morning for the latest in South Jersey weather Facebook and Instagram at Joe Mark WX is where you can find me Twitter at AC Press Martucci or the press of AC.com slash weather